Hi guys, welcome back. That's so ugly. Hi guys, welcome back to the vlog. If you're new, my name is Kiana. It's a vibe. Subscribe. Anyway, <laughs> I should do that. Oh my god, that would be so cringe if I made that like a thing. Anyways, it's Christmas Eve. So this vlog is very like, honestly, I don't know. Let me not put any like expectations on what to expect. We're gonna go with the flow. But for now, I'm actually gonna run to the mall really quickly. I need to get some last minute gifts and I'm helping someone choose a gift for someone else. Like it's confusing, but I don't know if they want me to share. So that's why I'm not calling names. And then I'm gonna actually show you guys what I got for everyone, like my family, my friends. It's not a lot of gifts but they're solid gifts i won't lie i kind of benefit from a couple of these gifts i think i benefit from all but one of these gifts which is like <laughs> Loki fucked up, Loki kind of nice, you know what I'm saying, I'm saying, anyways. So yeah, I'm very excited for today. I'm also getting my hair done after work. Um, Yeah, I'm working today. I have a half day, but I actually have to work a full day because I took my half day yesterday. But um, yeah, so I'm just gonna run to the mall, head back, talk to you guys, get my hair done. So yeah, we're just gonna kick off a busy day and I'm excited to take you guys along. Might bring it into Christmas, show you guys what I get, I guess, if anyone cares. Um, my mom is making it seem like she got me some grand gift so we'll be the judge of that because <laughs> Um, so yeah, if you guys are new, my name is Kiana. I don't know. I think I said that I did the introduction already Okay, subscribe if you want to Okay, bye <laughs> Came for me Oh my YouTube paycheck mom, probably Probably my YouTube paycheck kind of have been for a while i'm gonna show you guys what i got everyone for christmas um make sure you guys can't see my addy i don't have um scissors and it's so nice that my nails are long enough to actually rip everything off all right so i'm so excited i got my mom a juicer. I got her a uh, juicer from Amazon. Um, I had asked them to put it in a second box because I didn't want her to see the labeling because she kind of would have known it was some house equipment and then she would say okay well what don't I have. I don't think I should open this box because I haven't even wrapped it yet so you know give her some stuff to unbox I guess. I need to go get some wrapping paper so when I leave for my hair appointment I'm probably just gonna quickly stop at the dollar store and then grab everything. Maybe I'll do gift bags. Honestly, I'm not a wrapping paper kind of person. I've never wrapped a gift in my life, I think. I don't know, it's just a waste of time. Well, not a waste of time, but it's just not for me. <laughs> and then for Jaden, I got this perfume. This is what it's... Can you not focus on me? I know I'm the star. Okay, this is what I got for Jaden. It smells really nice. I smelled it in store. Smelt, smelled, smelled it smelt it in store <laughs> leave me alone yeah so i went in store to see how it smells and it's nice we were on the phone one day in like october and we were talking about perfumes and stuff and this i had in my cart from that conversation i don't really remember why i chose this but i'm gonna go with it because it was in my cart so i put it there for a reason maybe she knows or maybe this was just something random i put in the cart but that's what i got for her 
And then for Brie, I'm gonna pop it on the screen what I got for Brie because it's not here yet and it's not gonna come till like the 28th because I ordered it really late. I ended up getting us friendship bracelets because a couple months ago, I think September, I don't know, she sent me a TikTok and it was like three girls that got matching friendship bracelets and she was like, we should do this. So I got her the bracelet and me the bracelet. And so that's why I said to you guys, a lot of the gifts kind of benefit me because I get a bracelet, she gets a bracelet, even though I had to pay for both the bracelets, but it's fine. And then for Perita, so you know those immersive art exhibitions? I got tickets for the both of us. And so I messaged her yesterday and I was like, art, cause obviously you have to buy the tickets with date and time. So I was like, are you free on December 30th? Which is when we were supposed to go to the Keitronada concert. So I was like, oh, we're gonna go somewhere downtown. So just be ready for this time on the 30th. But I'm gonna tell her where we're going on the day, just not until then though, because I want her to dress for the occasion. Like you can wear anything in there, but you know, like it's a cool event and you can obviously just take nice pictures there too. So maybe she wants to dress for the occasion. So we're gonna go to the Monet one, like the Beyond Monet, Claude Monet, I think. Honestly, I'm not really into art, but one reason I want to get that for her is because she wants to channel a lot of creative energy for next year. And I think it's a good place for anyone that wants to get into that kind of mindset to go. I don't know if she's been before, so that's the only thing too, but I feel like she'll like it nonetheless. It's a thought that counts, you know? So yeah, that's what I got everyone. I have one more gift to get for my sister and her mom. So like two gifts, I'm gonna see them on Monday. So I have some time, maybe I'll go back and think about it on Sunday, but yeah. The water didn't catch this one braid and it's bothering me. Can you not, can you not embarrass me? So obviously I'm back home and I kind of wanted to give you guys a review on this journal that I got well, in one of the last vlogs from Indigo. It's called, the, I'm like trying to peek but also get it to focus on this book. It's called The Story of My Life and it basically, so it's not really a journal for journaling but you're sharing stories. So it'll give you a prompt like, I'll just read one on a random page. Describe your romantic life in college or at this age. So I guess in the age of like 18 to 22, whatever. And you basically tell the story as opposed to like reflecting on it. So it's like you would tell the story as if you're telling a stranger or someone like that, right? And I kind of just really like the idea of all these things about me in a book. It's kind of like my autobiography, you know? It's just a vibe. So I just wanted to share it with you guys because I did say I would give my reviews on it and someone asked me in my DM either this morning or yesterday and I was like, oh, like I forgot I was, I was like, oh, I forgot I said which. I was like, oh, I forgot. <laughs> I'm drunk. Okay, guys. <laughs> I've been drinking. Okay, leave me alone. <laughs> leave me alone. Anyways. I forgot I said I would share my thoughts. So I wanted to just tap in and share with you guys how I've been feeling about this. And it's really been making me have some breakthroughs because what usually happens is after I write the story, I'll go in my journal and actually reflect on it. So I've been taking my time as I go through this. And yeah, you get to write prompts about your childhood, your adolescent years, and then your adulthood. Right now I'm not really focusing on the adulthood section because a lot of them are about like marriage and kids and obviously I'm not married. And I hope you guys watched a little like Life update you would know I'm single so I'm not married <laughs> so that's it's not happening anytime soon and it's not happening any and it's not happening anytime soon anyways so yeah I just wanted to share that with you guys I do recommend it it's $14.95 so $15 I love how they always do that shit $14.95 just put $15 man <laughs> um but yeah, I just wanted to share that with you all if you were interested and I wish everyone lived in one country so that I could just ship things to people like when I do the giveaway. Oh, I'm doing the giveaway in this video. I should have said that at the start. I'll probably insert a scene so that you guys know. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna do the giveaway at the end of this video. So stick around if you're still watching or don't skip to the end. Push. Hello, Merry Christmas all my peeps. It is 9.45, I've been up since six, so I know I'm gonna take a fat sleep tonight. Hopefully I can fall asleep early because of that, because I've been staying up so late. I went to bed at like 1 p.m. a.m. <laughs> since I woke up so early and naturally my family wakes up early, we just got to unboxing gifts really early as well, as you guys would have seen. 
I was about to say would have sawn. Can I speak? Um, so yeah, I kind of wanted to show you guys what I got myself, what I got from my family and just, you know, that look of vibes. So first thing I got was this perfume from my mom. She got me this. It's so cute and it's pink and I've been telling her, oh, I want to get more into fragrances and I want to stop using yours. And that was a hint for her to get me a perfume. I know we talked about the blender, but this is nice. So, you know, I'm just going to buy the blender myself. It's okay. And then something I got for myself, I got three tops from Aritzia. I kind of used it as an investment. I wish my YouTube channel was big enough that I could write this off as a business expense, but I got them for myself. Of course, I can wear them to dinner and stuff with my friends, but I mostly wanted some tops for sit down videos just to look more classy and cute and clean as opposed to all the t-shirts that I own. I got one of the Sculpt Knit tanks in cream i'll put the exact color on the screen i don't know but it's just a simple tank good quality aritzia you know the drill and then i got the same top in red such a vibe it's giving very festive and it's just different because i have so many neutrals and i don't own anything that's red which is crazy it's cute i like the color i actually like the red more than the beige and then the third top i got it was this pink kind of wrap shirt i don't know but i will say the shirt feels kind of big in the like boob area i feel like i don't have enough to fill it in but i'm gonna see how it looks when i put on like a strapless bra or something just to give it some oomph because right now it's 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 kind of loose i don't know but it's okay it's still cute i should have tried it on before i took the receipt off it but it's okay um i'll still get some wear out of it so yeah oh and then the last thing i got were these shoes they're so nice they're so cute i naturally would not i probably would not have purchased this for myself but that's why i like it because it forces me out my comfort zone and i know i'll wear it because last night i was actually looking at shoes like that to buy myself one or to put on my wish list because honestly i'm done spending money on myself in that regard in terms of shopping for the rest of the year at least like well the year ends in a week but for a while like i need to cut it out like it's not cute anymore <laughs> So yeah, that's what went on for Christmas. And I got a gift card for Starbucks from Perito. So that's cute. Um, And yeah, right now my family's making dinner. Um, Yeah, we start early because we do it more like brunch. Um, So yeah, <laughs> I'm going to watch YouTube videos all day. Honestly, I went into a deep journaling session last night. So here are the stack of books. And I always just sleep with them on the bed because I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, I just wanted to update you guys. Hey guy, is there anything in my teeth? I only check because I just ate cake and yeah. Anyways, I wanted to wrap up the vlog and give you guys some info on the giveaway. So how the giveaway is gonna work is in the next four videos that I post, so today being the first one and then the three after that, they might all come out this week, they might not. So just in the next four videos, just keep your eyes peeled. I'm gonna ask you a question and all you have to do is comment down below what you think or your answer. And that's how I'm just gonna choose a winner. I'm really not sure yet if it's gonna be like a random selection i think that is probably what i will do that is what i will do because it's just only fair i don't want to be the person that judges whether your answer is good enough or not good enough so in the next four videos in each video i'm gonna ask you a question you comment down below your answer and the winner of each video is gonna receive a 50 dollar visa gift card so at first i really debated with the idea of the prize i was gonna issue gift cards from stores that like are specific to me so like sephora aritzia 
Ikea, Starbucks, all that stuff. I realize that people are from different countries. I realize that, you know, not everyone necessarily wants the things that I want. And I just know that like, you know, I would prefer if I get the option to just do what I want. And my aim with this whole giveaway is just to give back to you guys. I got my first YouTube paycheck, which I think I mentioned in like some text in this video because I already started editing it. So I know. Um, and it's just been a really good thing to feel like, you know, I finally earned some money from YouTube. It feels so surreal and my priorities to just give back like that's something I definitely want to do as I grow more on my channel so I hope that's not confusing I know I'm talking a lot so I'm just gonna explain it once more for anyone that is just like Kiana can you just get to the point so in the next four videos today being the first video I'm going to ask you a question you just have to comment down below what your response is I'm gonna throw everyone that comments an answer into a random generator and then pick a person and you'll get a $50 visa gift card which means you can spend it however you want wherever you want and just make your life easier with the extra money I know it's not that much money but $50 is $50 <laughs> so I mean do with it what you may so the question for today's video is comment down below a person a podcast a quote or something meaningful that has helped you get through the year I'll give an example for me hmm, what is my answer hmm <laughs> <laughs> what has gotten me through this year? Okay, I'll go. I think a podcast that has gotten me through this year is Anything Goes by Emma Chamberlain. I remember earlier in this year, I, it's when I started listening to it and I said to you guys in my How to Become That Girl video, which really was just for views because it had nothing to do with really becoming that girl. But I remember saying like, I just started listening to her podcast. I've always been hesitant because I don't normally listen to advice from people younger than me. Just because like, you know, sometimes I think you're still figuring things out especially because Emma's 20 and I'm 20 I was gonna say 24 I'm 23 almost 24 but I just really like her podcast because she's learning so much about herself and about her life and about the world and sometimes she just comes with such simple conclusions and I think as you get older, you feel like there's some big complicated answer to a lot of the things you stress about when really the core answer is just this simple one liner that like she will say in her podcast. I don't know if that makes any sense. If you listen to her podcast, maybe you'll understand. Like sometimes she'll give explanations by saying the most simple, like straightforward stuff. And you're like, yeah, that probably is just the answer. Like as simple and straightforward as she says it, it's not anything much deeper than that. Sometimes it is, sometimes it isn't. But I just like that freshness from her podcast, that rawness, that just like, this is my life. This is what I'm learning. Here you go. Yeah, that's something that's really helped me get through the year. My camera is gonna die. Let me save this clip. So that's basically it. Comment down below your answer and I'll pick a person and you'll win a gift card. If you guys liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to. Merry X Christmas because Christmas it, it will be posted the day after Christmas and I will see you guys in the next video.